Hey everybody, how's it going? Daryl here. Welcome to the channel. The fine folks at La Luce Knots have sent me a fog machine to review. This fog machine is very versatile as it is equipped with two lights and it can shoot vertically as well as horizontally. So before we unbox this thing, I just want to let you know that you can pick this up on Amazon for $142 and I have a link in the description below and clicking on that link helps support this channel. So without further ado, let's go ahead and unbox this thing. We have our inner box. So it comes with a nice branded manual with pictures, an IEC power cord, a bag of goodies which we'll go over in just a moment. And we have our fog machine, our wireless control module and an IR remote to control fog output as well as the colors of this fog machine. Here we have our fog machine. The box was pretty big, so I was worried this would be really bulky, but this is about 11 pounds, so it has some heft to it, but it's not too crazy. And on the front here, you see this magic ball effect, as well as the stream where the fog comes out, and six three watt RGB LEDs. We have our tank right here, and it is secured by this metal strap. It has a handle on top and on this side. It's lightweight enough that you can pick it up on one handle. On this side, you can see that there is a fan. On the bottom, it has four rubber feet. And on this side, it also has four rubber feet. Remember how I said this thing can shoot vertically or horizontally? Well, it can either rest on these four feet and shoot out like that, like a more traditional fog machine, or on the bottom like that. And this side also features a fan. So on the back here, as you can see, it has an on and off switch, an auto fog machine that can be toggled on or off so that it can just be continuously releasing bursts of fog. This is where you plug it in for power and you can use any IEC cable if you lose the original one. And you see this three prong input. So you might be thinking, oh, this might have DMX. This does not have DMX, but you can plug in this wireless remote module. Just plug it in right there. And there you go. Now you can control this wirelessly with the eye remote. Control the lighting functions as well as the fog. And that green light is the indicator letting you know that the fog is ready for dispersion. And on the side with the handle, there's a gauge to see how much fog is in your device. This fog machine has a warm up time of four minutes and a reheating time of 10 seconds. And this also features a really high output and it releases 27 second bursts. It's a thousand Watts. And it has a 1.3 liter tank capacity and it sprays out about 10 to 16 feet with an 8,000 CFM and the lights and the fog work hand in hand to create an impressive effect. Notice that it has this remote on the top here. This is like the fog on and off. So that's how you can like turn on the magic ball. You can have the lights do like a fade or a jump or just choose a single static color. All right, so that's the specs. Let's go ahead and try this thing out. Fog juice is not included. You can use any fog juice you want. I'll leave a link in the description below for one. The two lights can be controlled independently, so you can have one of them on and one of them off. I'll speed this up because it really does shoot for 27 seconds straight. This fog machine is fantastic at filling a large space quickly with fog. All right, what do I think about this fog machine? I think the versatility of being able to shoot vertically or horizontally is pretty cool. I think that these six LEDs right here create a really cool effect when you're shooting the smoke. I'm not a huge fan of this magic ball effect in general, but I know that there are others that like it, and if you like it, I think this is a good implementation of it. In fact, I'm gonna turn it off. 
Um, I think it outputs pretty good output and it looks really good. Some of the thoughtful features like the auto bursts so you don't have to manually trigger it is really nice and a wireless IR remote is pretty cool. Although it'd be cool if I could wirelessly control it without this dangling thing in the back if it had something built in. Um, it's pretty ergonomic. It's pretty easy to carry with these two handles. All right, so what do I think about this for like professional use? Well, professionals really aren't using fog machines in the world of mobile DJing because a lot of venues have fire alarms and smoke machines can infamously trigger the fire alarms. It can pretty much disrupt an entire event or even end the event if you have the fog machine trigger the fire alarm and sometimes that even triggers the automated sprinklers. So a lot of professionals aren't using fog machines. And the fact that this shoots upwards can reach the fire alarm quicker, but even though this can shoot horizontally, do not be mistaken, it will also reach to the sky and trigger those fire alarms. But you know, there are venues that are equipped to deal with smoke machines and there are outdoor events as well where you don't have to worry about that. So this while this fog machine can just like auto disperse fog and that's really nice that it goes upwards because it can catch like your movers outdoors quickly. And this is better than a haze machine for an outdoor thing because of the high density output. And I still think I would like to see a couple of features on this to be able to use it in a professional setting. And don't get me wrong, this is $140. This isn't the Chauvet Geyser, which is like $500. I would want to lose this magic disco ball thing. Um, it'd be really cool that as the fog disperses, that's when the lights turn on and only then. It just creates a cool effect and DMX control. So you definitely can use a fog machine without DMX. But in effect, like a geyser where it shoots up and you want it to shoot up during like a drop or really exciting part of a performance, you want DMX, you can have more control over that. I suppose you could have some stage people pushing the on button manually, but no, we don't want that. We want DMX. I remotes aren't reliable as DMX. So yeah, there you go. So overall, this is a really cool fog machine. I think it'll be great for like Halloween celebrations, parties, outdoor events. So what are your thoughts on this fog machine? What are your questions? Let me know down below and please smash like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.